Good morning. All prophets. Sunday of all prophets. May 16. Well, prophets, I pray in America, Georgia, Atlanta, Tuesday night of 9 p.m. of May 17 to the turn. I see shooting a plane just here. Good afternoon. We're going to begin with breaking news. Gwinnett County Police just making an arrest after a violent shooting leaves a woman dead. Another woman hurt at an apartment complex. This is in Lawrenceville. Our Tracen Bragg has been following the story all morning long. Joins us live from the St. Tracen. What are we learning? I know we have uh, seen the names of the victims now. That's right, Karen. I mean, police aren't only announcing an arrest, but they're also mentioning what charges the suspect is now facing after that double shooting here at this apartment complex. And the folks I spoke to who live here say they are still in shock. Gwinnett, please tell me this man, 53-year-old Brian Miller, is now behind bars facing charges of felony murder and two counts of aggravated assault. They say Miller pulled the trigger in a deadly shooting at the reflections on Sweetwater apartment complex. Wow, no, no, no. This is scary. This is very scary in this moment. Investigators swarmed the complex after the deadly shots were fired just before 10 last night. They say Miller shot two women. 62-year-old Gracie Miller was killed in the shooting. 44-year-old Shamom Morris, a relative visiting from New York, was shot but survived. She's now recovering in a nearby hospital. Putting in the position of the family, just very sorry about what happened. Now, if you noticed, both the suspect and the woman who died share the same last name, that last name, of course, being Miller. I'm reaching out to Gwinnett County Police to see if they can confirm their relationship to find out if they were married or not, as police are calling this a domestic incident. Reporting live in Gwinnett County, I'm Tracen Bragg, CBS 46 News. All right, Tracen, thanks for the update. Breaking news.